guys! Kumusta? If you're new here, ako nga pala si Matilda Brat. And welcome to my very first book review. Today, I will be reviewing the book Sad Girls by Langlive. So this is my first Langlive book. I bought it uh, sa carousel. And initially, I didn't want to buy this kasi iba yung libro na hinahanap ko sa carousel. I was looking for um, Lunar Chronicles nang makita ko to siya doon. So, um, may pusa. <laughs> sa labas namin. So, I, I wasn't I was looking for Lunar Chronicles sa, sa carousel when I saw this. And kasi I thought all of her books, all of Lang Lib's books are poems and medyo hindi ako fan ng poetry. Kasi when it comes to poetry, naaalala ko yung teacher ko sa high school, yung English teacher namin na um, there was a lesson once na pinapa-analyze niya yung mga poems. <laughs> Kaya when I see poems, parang automatic na. Um, ina-analyze ng utak ko and hindi, hindi, ako, hindi ako gusto <laughs> but then I found out that is this is a novel pala so I bought it and mura lang siya um, 350 pesos akala, akala ko nga ano parang scam <laughs> kasi di ba yung mga books ni Lang Live uh, most of them mga around 700 and up so there so, binili ko siya and when I got this, I was surprised. Kasi malaki siya. You can see. Oh. Malaki talaga siya. Diba yung mga books ni Lang Live, especially yung mga poetry books niya, um, maliit lang. Parang notebook. But this one is very big. So kaya, I'm really glad na binili ko to. <laughs> Medyo dark yung story ng Sad Girls. And it's not for those who are uncomfortable with themes like suicide, self-harm, drug abuse, and um, infidelity, and stuff like that. So, when I was reading this, uh, medyo natagalan ako sa pagtapos. Kasi, I find it medyo slow for me. Medyo slow yung pacing ng story. And probably because I was also reading another book when I was reading this. I was reading a, reading a thriller. So, alam niyo naman yung mga thriller, di ba? Medyo mabilis yung um, takbo ng story. So, I was reading like a chapter of this, tapos three chapters, four chapters of thriller. So, talagang matagal ko siyang natapos. But all in all, okay naman siya. So, what is Sad Girls all about? Sad Girls is about a girl named Audrey who told a lie about her classmate named Anna. So Audrey told her friends Lucy and Candela that she saw Audrey being sexually abused by her father. And the lie spread like wildfire. Pinaniwala naman dun sa lugar nila. And then after a few days, Si Anna ay natagpo ang patay sa bathtub with a slit on her wrists. So, there. And after that, doon din nagsimula yung panic attacks ni Audrey. Siguro um, because of her guilt, kaya nag-umpisa yung mga panic attacks niya. And then, moving forward, Anna attended... I mean, Audrey, nakakalito. Nakakalito yung pangalan nila. Audrey attended um, Anna's funeral. And then, doon sa funeral, nakilala ni Anna, ang boyfriend. I mean, nakilala ni Audrey. I told you, nakakalito yung mga names. Nak nakilala ni Audrey, yung boyfriend ni Anna, na si Rad. And then, there was an instant connection between them. Parang instant attraction siguro. Parang ganun sa kanila between Audrey and Rad. And considering, ano, 
Audrey has a boyfriend, si Doc. So, yun. So, there are a few things that I don't like about um, sad girls. Um, first is the characters. Medyo kulang sila sa growth. Um, I didn't really like Audrey. Um, talagang, when I was reading this, nakakagigil siya. Kasi, she told a lie. Um, walang rason. Walang reason. Um, she would just say, she's a teenager. And teenagers lie. But then, yung lie na sinabi niya ay, ano, um, caused pain to the people around her. Um, especially to her friend, kay Candela, and sa parents ni Anna. Kasi nga, it was a lie. Hindi totoo yung sinabi niya na Anna was uh, sexually abused by her father. Tapos itong si Audrey, um, she hates her mom. Kasi nga, her mom um, cheated. Nung bata pa si Candela, I mean si Audrey. <laughs> Um, her mom cheated on someone else. But then, Audrey also cheated. Parang, ano ba girl, you hate your mom so much, but then, ano nangyari sa'yo? You're just like your mom. But then, despite the fact na nagsinumaling siya, Audrey is still a very lucky girl. Kasi, she was able to get a job straight out, out of high school. Um, hindi nga niya natapos yung mga exams. She was able to get a job. And then, she moved out of her parents' house. And, no, nakahanap sila, nakakita sila ng bahay, which was Lucy's uncle's house. And, they didn't have to pay for the rent. Kasi nga, they were house-sitting the house for Lucy's uncle. So, di ba? Despite what she did, she lied, she cheated, ano pa rin, um, maswerte pa rin siya. And then, when the time came na hindi naging maayos yung relationship nila ni Rad, um, Audrey went to Colorado. At hanggang doon, umabot yung swerte niya. <laughs> Kasi, um, she was only living with her, using her savings. Pero, she was able to find a house to house sit. Uso sa kanila yung house sitting eh. There was this couple na naghanap ng house sitter kasi aalis sila. So, she was lucky to live in their house for free. And also before that, um, she was also able to get a promotion um, from junior um, writer, journalist ba yun, naging ano siya, senior um, journalist and just a matter of a year, a year siguro. So, she's a very lucky girl. And then, in Colorado, she met a nice guy. Um, I think the name was Gabe. And I really thought na si Gabe na talaga yung makakatuluyan niya. But, sadly, no. Kasi, she's Audrey and she's complicated. So, yun. And the second one that I didn't like about this is, um... What happened to Lucy? Lucy is my favorite character. She's like the positive energy of the story. Um, wala lang, ano lang siya. She's cool and she's positive. Walang negative vibes. But then, lang leave. <laughs> lang langga. <laughs> Something happened to um, Lucy. And I... Hindi ko nagustuhan. I really think she did not deserve that. Lucy is such a good girl. Sayang. And I also did not like the ending. <laughs> I'm sorry sa mga fans ni Lang Live. Um, kasi I thought Audrey would redeem herself. I thought she would come clean. Pero hindi. Um, parang, parang nadapa siya sa putik. Tapos, since nalapa na siya, parang, dito na ako titira. Parang <laughs> ganun. Um, and also, si Rad, he didn't get what he deserved. So, yun. Very, ano, yun. <laughs> so, I didn't like the ending. And also, 
isa pa, parang disturbing is yung um, parang letter or diary ni Anna. Kasi itong si Anna, she's the sad girl. Super sad girl. Parang I think she has depression. Um, kasi she writes in her diary and ilang beses siyang um, she tried to commit suicide a few times and then she has suicidal thoughts na sinusulat niya dun sa diary niya. And then, spoiler, the very last part, very last part of the book is um, yung diary ni, ano, diary ni Anna. And parang questionable yung decision, yung morality niya, yung pinagsasabi niya. Siguro nga because of her uh, mental state, kaya ganun. And the things I like sa story na to. First is, I like the writing style. Although, medyo nakulangan ako. Medyo, there were some parts na medyo lacking. Pero, I like her writing style. Talagang, makikita mo yung pagiging, ano niya, poetic, very creative. And I'll quote my favorite part here. He poured the rest into my glass. Then he got up and positioned his chair so it was next to mine. We were quiet as we watched the sky transition from pink to gold to orange in a stunning interplay of color and light. So, diba, she's just describing the sunset. Pero, very poetic, very romantic yung pag describe the sunset. And another thing that I liked is this. Ang nasa likod. If you can see... There are only four lines here, but the, the, these four lines are very powerful. So it says, a girl who cried wolf, a boy in sheep's clothing, a killer romance, a deadly secret. Diba? It's very powerful. So, siguro, kung ako makikita ko to sa, ano, sa bookstore, diba sa bookstore, yung mga books nila are sealed. So, if makikita ko to sa shelf, tapos nabasa ko to, ito lang ang mabasa ko, I would really buy it because it's intriguing, mysterious, and I like stuff like that. So, yun, ito, nagustuhan ko to. And also, I like that twist about Rad. Although, gaya na sinabi ko, he did not get what he deserved. Rad. Pero, talagang nagulat ako. Kasi I like, I like books na parang gugulatin ka so surprise ka in ways na hindi mo talaga ini expect so i like the twist about him i will not tell it i like the twist and talaga i did not see it coming yun lang masasabi ko i like that part so much so my rating paano nga ba kita rate <laughs> i think i'll give it um a 3 3 stars kasi i enjoyed reading it naman but then medyo Hindi ko nga gusto yung character, si Audrey. But still, it's a good read. Um, I enjoyed it. I was entertained. Um, I recommend it to Langley fans. And also, to those who are looking for um, unconventional love stories. So ito, I highly recommend it. But be careful sa mga ano those of you who are sensitive sa mga dark themes kasi nga, gaya ng sinabi ko, may mga ano siya, um, suicide, um, self-harm, drug abuse. So, yun. So, do you agree with my rating? <laughs> sa mga nakapagbasa na nito, please tell me your thoughts. Don't forget to leave a comment kung pareha ba tayo ng ano, opinion about it. And if you haven't read the book, please Go ahead and do so. Tapos, comment nyo kung ano yung masasabi nyo tungkol sa libro na to. So, I hope you like this video. At kung hindi man, mo I'm sorry. <laughs> First time kasi mag-review ng book. But, this is not the last time. So, I'll be reviewing more books. And if you have suggestions or if you have requests, feel free to leave a comment. And thank you for watching. Till next time.